today we're checking out my boy burner man now I, I seen this video actually post about a couple weeks ago shout out to bootleg kev i do watch your podcast shit is very interesting um as a matter of fact i've seen bootleg kev i met bootleg kev and i met burner at the zap olympics the zamp olympics or something it was that uh smokers event downtown la this year i think it happened like a couple months ago that shit was dope I met my girl Corlay too. I recommend you guys go to the next one. I think they do it once a year. Uh, and they have it in LA. And I think they do one like in San Francisco and different areas. But shout out to Burner, man. That shit was cool. Uh, I'm a big fan of Burner. You know, I, I'm a big. I like what he represents. I like how he carries himself, the entrepreneur, the lifestyle. You know, he. I'll put him up there with Nipsey Hussle. I'll put him up there with Rick Ross. Just that, that that lifestyle. And shout out to him again for making Forbes. You gotta have money. And right here you could tell off the title. Let's blow this shit up a little bit. So we give him burning his flowers right now. Especially for your, from your boy Marathon Chris. So if you do end up catching this, man. I'm, I tap in, man. I'm a proud to pay customer, man. And then uh, I'm out in Long Beach. So, oh, shh, shh. It's terrible, too, hearing about the news about his store shutting down in L.A. I don't know what's going on with the building, but I would say, man, put up another store in L.A. You got customers that are proud to pay. Hopefully, I can join your team one day. But, okay, let's get right into it, y'all. Burner gives an exclusive tour of a multi-million dollar cookies compound. This man's this man brings in the dough. And you can always pick up a few things from this listening to you folks like this. All right, let's go. Yeah. All right, man, Bay Area with this one. This man, Burner, no, he just. Alright, buckle up for this one. Let's go. That's not long. Two years and it's already up. I'm telling you, this reminds me of Neighborhood Nip when he had his uh, place down in Burbank. You know, he had like secret little facilities, secret little places where you and your homies could meet up. It's it's key. It's key to have shit like that, you know what I'm saying? It's very hard to work at home, your comfortability, because in your bedroom, your bedroom is a is, is sanctuary. You're not supposed to keep TVs in your bedroom. You're not supposed to keep certain things. And you're not going to get your full thinking process. You got your kids at home. You got your wife. You're in daddy mode. You know, some folks, you know, you're just in, your, you're in a different mode at home. You can't do, can't bring out your work productivity at home. I stress that a lot of people get out the house, leave. You got to go somewhere. Where's the start? This is like a whole That shit, that's like a nightclub. Strip club. You <laughs> just missing a pole. I seen a video about Kevin. Uh, he, he, he a freak, him and his lady. I, mean, I ain't gonna get into that. That man's personal business or nothing. But that shit is clean though. He got a kitchen. I mean, I would love to have something like this. Don't get me wrong. I would love to have me some weed like that. But I, I wouldn't want to sell weed. I would like maybe like a gym with a kitchen in it. Or even somewhere where like your cars. Somebody could work on your car. Anything, you know. But that shit is nice. And a kitchen too. Psh, you you could live there. It's just more like for snacks and stuff like that. You know, snacks. <laughs> Hell yeah, I had everything. Seven thousand square feet. It might be like movie scenes of like the belly. You know how they show like the the strip clubs, the night lights when they go through that fuck, the hangling, the dangling, backstage shit. Got 
This is where the cozy kitchen happens. This is a <sighs> kitchen. Yeah, if you follow Burner on IG, he's been posting a lot of food content. And that shit's been fire. Like, he makes... It's like real nice, delicate, exquisite plates. Look at that. I know some words. You know, he makes good food like... Baked fish. Uh, just go check out his page, man. That shit make you hungry as well. It make you high and it make you hungry. It's a perfect combination. This is a huge fucking hood. The music coming from the hood right here. We got two speakers inside the hood. I don't know what else they got. Speakers. Like That's fucking also, nice. Speakers in your kitchen. One and one shit. You see my name on the, on the oven right there. Of course. Man, I always see the guy on YouTube with this thing. Uh, Top tire. Now that's fire. Now that would be a delicate asset of having it in your house. Not delicate, but that would be something. Man, you could cook everything. Burgers, tacos, steaks. And something about a flat grill with that surface that just opened. Oh, I see. I, I always wanted a kitchen with an island where you could just walk around. Well, you don't have to be just put in one corner. That's got to get your funds up, baby. That's what we're working on right now, man. But something like oh, I would love to have something like that. You can cook so much shit on each corner. It remind me, okay, so I've been to, you know those Mexican restaurants where they have those hot bowls where they serve you, where they literally can cook the food on the bowl, and they'll serve it to you, and that shit just, shh. God damn, it's fire. Fried rice, everything. This is probably one of the most expensive one pieces I've ever That's bought. dope. It's like That's scary. Imagine they coming into the house drunk or high, lights off, seeing that shit. Shoot that motherfucker down. That shit's dope, though. Look, I think it even got like the cookie symbol. I don't know if it's custom made, but that shit's nice. Shout out to the artist on that one. Right. I mean, I don't know about the LSD, but. The thoughts that be going on in people's mind. Look at this picture, though, y'all. Like, really look at it, though. No, for real. Like, that shit's trippy. First thing I notice is the drowning people reaching out, and if you keep looking at it, it's it's the San Francisco Bay Area Bridge, and I feel like a lot of people has died off that bridge, or a lot of people has been tossed over that bridge. You don't know what the hell's down there, but symbolism, pictures bring out big symbolism. Shout out to that Selena shirt that Kevin's rocking as well. Hey. Fuck cancer. Reach new eyes. Zagzilla, shout out to Zagzilla. Hash. I used to be big on hash back in high school. Thank God I got over it. Well, thank God I didn't have the funds for it, and the body, and the tolerance. If you if you below one sixty, it's not for you. Just stick with just stick with your marijuana, baby. Um, that shit used to put me out like one hit. It fuck up my whole damn day. I remember I, I bought Del Taco with my homie one day. And it was probably like 7 o'clock. We took a few hash hits. We probably popped back up at like 5 in the morning. And that shit, it was just like, god damn. The whole Friday night just fucked. Honestly, it just fucked. So, and I'm lazy too. So, the whole thought of just torching 
getting shit hot, the wax process. My homie, he actually owns a smoke shop. Shout out to my boy, Shy Fresno Smoke Shop, Valley Smoke Shop, baby. Tap in if you're in that area. He got all the products you need. He got the, yeah, he got what the celebrities want. He got everything. I kid you not, he, he has the number one smoke shop. But he used to have it, not sell it. We used to have it. Uh, and you got to drive. I mean, it was like 45 minute drive just to get it. And I fell out of love with it. But hey, tap it with the cookies product, man. They do be uh, pushing these products hard to hash. Did I already tell you I met this man? Yes, I did. Yes, sir. <laughs> Got your own personals. Look at that. You got to have your name on your product name on everything. And he owns cookies, right? He's full ownership of cookies. That's 100% everything he has, right? That's fucking, that's dope. Never buy his clothing. Uh, that's one reason. I, I mean, not one reason. I don't know why. I have no reason. Why I haven't purchased any cookies product, but I did see on his IG he's drop he's dropping like some all white cookie Air Force One types, so they're like proto proto prototypes right now. I can't even think right now, y'all. But um, as soon as he drops those, I'm copying for show. Yes, sir. Look at that. Yes, sir. Come on now. Gotta do it right. Exactly. You work hard. Forbes, there it is. Self made, baby. Hey. Shout out to moms. Shout out to all the moms out there, baby. I love you, mom. I know you be watching my videos and just know you just know you, your young man's doing okay. He's she's she's fine and I love you. And I'm not out here, I'm not out here terrorizing folks. We're on a good path. And then uh, shout out to all the moms out there. You know, for real. Beautiful picture, of course. Money. Smash room. <laughs> boom boom room. That shit clean, boys. This my yeah, club. Right. Got to do something with your money, right? Other than that, taxes. You got to do something. Hey, Burner, I'm sending the resume. I mean, I ain't got my, um, I don't got, like, my camera production resume, but check out my work, man. I got some good edits on my IG page. I'm down with the marathon. I'm down with the grind. I'm a good stand-up. Hell yeah, I'm applying, baby. Nah, but yeah, hook me up, bro. Hey, sh not hook me up, but... Hell yeah. I would love to join the operation. Hell yeah. Smoke all day too? But I'm going to get get some work done? Put some black folks with you right here, baby. Right here. Detail. Everything's just detail. Taste, it's good taste. Look at it. What the fuck another kitchen? Not one but two kitchens. Gotta throw that out there, right? 
So he's got a he's got his own display production room, and that's that's very smart to have right there. Take note, people, right there. So when you do have investors coming through, not just you're only talking about it, you get to show them. You know, this is this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm made of. Like this is this is the dream. And I'm like, Shh, run with it, of course, right? Presentation. Cookies dispensary. And you in. know they're smoking in yeah. there. This is like a little mini. If you've ever been into a cookies, you know. So yes, sir. Like I had a chance to visit the LA store a couple times. Right. Bunner, he don't even know what to do with his money. I mean, he knows exactly what to do with his money, but he's just the type of just, I'm pretty sure he got everything he want already. Like, I want a refrigerator that talks. I want a fish tank on the bottom of the floor that stays clean. I want three kitchens. I want, I want a jacuzzi that extends out. Yeah, I need this all by tomorrow. Put on my tab, type of nigga like shit. Don't face him. Success, success is nasty, man. Success is nasty. Never let up. Hey, that's the content creator room right there. That's what I'll be at. <laughs> yep. So when you do the inside the back shit, that that's the theme of that show is essentially like That's how my bedroom looks at home right now. If you really walk into my house and open up my bedroom, it literally it's it's two green screens. I have a table, two tables, I have two chairs in the back, I have like my camera stands. I bought so much extra shit to the part I just I don't have to break down, put it back together. It's already there. And this is some spooky shit if you see. I still got my bed in there, but it's crazy. Like I say, you know, it's it, it, it was hard for me to work in there cuz that's supposed to be your your place to rest. So it's hard to like lay down get up and start working lay down because it's either one or the other and you need a place where you, you just don't think about that right but that's dope though i'll be utilizing that room so much of course baby success for the family pass it down Right here, dog. I'm tapping in. Take a seat on the couch, Kev. Hit the bong. I don't think they are. <laughs> His butter, baby. <laughs> Everything's high level, man. I think that's why we love this, man. It's the style, how he carries himself, you know? Yes, sir. Y'all didn't see the warehouse spot. The warehouse is just this empty, blank slate of. I mean, and he got a warehouse. I know he got, he probably got spots everywhere throughout the fucking state. We got the exclusive first look. Cookies, the concept, baby. 
Shout out to Burner, man. Keep running up. It's a, he a multi-millionaire. He just made four 